can see the bone model right there and cartilage underneath it. Conmed Linvitec makes an array of medical devices, including many to repair knees, hips, and shoulders. But it's the foundation of our core technology of our people itself, through training, through education, that really makes all the difference. We can't recruit them into the programs fast enough. With support from the National Science Foundation, engineer Marilyn Barger directs the Florida Advanced Technological Education Center, or FLAIT, to create statewide programs to prepare workers for high-tech manufacturing jobs. They are getting skills that are very transferable across different areas of, in technology, that there's a lot of things they learn if they're in the advanced manufacturing track that might apply in optics or might apply in machining and metal fabrication. They are expressed in terms of maximum interrupting voltage. The FLATE curriculum focuses on skills needed to excel in today's advanced manufacturing workplace. We came up with a structured degree program that includes electronics, hydraulics, pneumatics, automation, and includes sensor technologies and process control. We work with industry and they begin defining what it is that these workers are expected to do. I wanted to start working on linear accelerators, um, hospital equipment that treats cancer patients. Many students enter these programs with college degrees or with military or work experience to improve their prospects for the future. It's the best part to this whole program was the ability to, uh, to take what you've done in the fields before and use your experiences uh, and put your hands on. These students know that contemporary manufacturing jobs require a much higher skill set than those of yesterday's assembly line worker. Very clean, very innovative, and people make some pretty good, pretty good money at that. It's just a wise move to have some manufacturing in, in the states uh, for quality reasons, security reasons, or just in terms of uh, the latest, greatest technology is only available here. The National Association of Manufacturers says there are as many as 600,000 skilled manufacturing positions vacant in the U.S. The folks at Flate are working to change that by engineering a high-tech workforce trained for success. For Science Nation, I'm Miles O'Brien.